gotcha. I gotta have somebody having my back, or somebody in my corner, and if I can get that guy to fucking... what I grab? Does it even tell me what I grab? Did I get batteries? I should. I think I got batteries. God damn it. I hate this fucking camera. This fucking camera. Alright. This battery batteries. should fit the radio. Great, thanks. And here's another one. Should be able to get it to work now. Hey, Tommy. Ah, uh, it's so still not working? Yeah, I can't figure it out. Let me have a look at that thing. Go ahead. Try to figure out this fucking radio. Press the power. Mm, nothing. Alright. Let's go ahead and flip it over. Swap them. Flip. Go, turn it around. Pop the power on. As the unknown affliction continues to spread unchecked, the estimated death toll continues to skyrocket. WABE urges you to stay indoors Lady, and avoid any contact with individuals you need some who sense. may have been exposed. The station is okay. In the event of a full uh, uh, my, my producer's told okay. me we have to get off the air. Okay, so, Steve, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guys. Try to get some rest. Huh? God bless you all. I'm sorry I turned on the radio. God damn, that's annoying. Alright. So I guess I'm gonna fucking. Well, what is this? Is this another candy bar? Yeah, I got another fucking candy bar, I think. Look it's outside. Not damaged. Glad this place didn't get looted. That's a lot of medication. Ah, uh, fuck. I gotta try to find Doug, but... This place is hard to fucking go around. There's copies, there's this. What does that even do? Nope. No, I'm sorry to hear your loved one was eaten by the living dead guards. That's not funny. How we doing? Good. Wanna go have a look around outside? Yes. Uh, let's, let's have, have a look around. around. Okay. See if I can't find anything out here. Jesus. <laughs> Fucking walkers. Just eat. As far as I can tell, he's all I care about. And if one gets you, they eat you. And whatever's left comes back as one of them. How the fuck? I think it might be more than a couple days before all this gets sorted out. Yeah, I think so too. We better keep it down out of here. Do I want to grab a flashlight from the outside? What else do I have to work with? Oh. TV remote? Think you can do anything with this? Yeah. I used to fiddle around with stuff like that when I was a kid, but there's not much to do with it now. Man, I miss my robots. You're a strange guy, Doug. I know. Um. Let me see. There's only two choi- well, wait. Huh. Look at the one trapped over there. Better hand on that thing. Oh shit. What? Do you know that guy? 
Uh... He could be a drugstore employee. So you're saying he might have the pharmacy keys? I'm saying he might have the pharmacy keys. I don't know. Could be anybody, you know. They start rotting and get all chewed up and... Shut up, Doug. Kind of somebody who I'm related to, Doug. So yeah, you need to shut the fuck up. Worked at the drugstore and died with keys in his pocket. It would take a lot of effort to make it safe enough to go out there and see if he has the keys. If we could somehow prove that he worked here, I think it'd be worth it. Prove? It's fucking Saul's ID card. I'm gonna try to grab that fucking card. Uh, that's a brick. God damn it. What is... what else is here? Huh. Why am I using a TV remote? You can do anything with this? You know what I could do? What's that? It's universal. I could program it to work with those TVs across the street. Just hope the power is still on. You can just do that? I memorized all the codes when I was in AB. Let's try. There well we go. Fucking done, Doug. All that dork nonsense might save a life. Who's to say it already hasn't? I got a few of them to take notice. But not enough. Uh, all right. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. I can't reach that brick. God damn it. How'd you end up here? I moved here to live with my uncle. He does tech stuff, and it just made sense. So you're local. You probably knew the owners of this What's place. up? No, not really. I've only been here a couple months and I spend a lot of time. On the computer? No, just doing my yep. own thing. What about you? Trying to fucking figure this out. I grew up here. Been trying to get home since the day I came back. Oh, so you probably knew the owners then? Yeah, I did. Good people. Maybe I can use. Oh, go back. Okay. Let me exhaust this dialogue first. Maybe I can use the uh, the cane. Um, Lee's dad's cane to uh, get the to reach the brick. We should think about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has some, but who knows if he actually worked here. Sarah, let's go back inside. Do you think we're safe here? Well, I haven't been able to get through this gate so far. And the drugstore's safe enough, I think. Whoever owned it took good care of it. It's well stocked and locks up well. Gotcha. Ah. Uh... Well, hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there unless the keys are out there for sure. God damn it. Okay. It's a combination lock. I can't reach that brick. God damn it. That's not what I even meant to do. Okay, we're going back inside, and I'm gonna go try to fucking Let's go, uh, inside. find that fucking, okay. uh, Grandpa Kane, or... That Kane... And this is where I was stuck last time I played this. It's the goddamn options. Okay, here, wait. We're gonna go in here. Go back.
I think he Lee tore that off for like a reason, but at the same time, like uh, the keys are on that zombie out on the street. Well, I'm trying to find something in here that's gonna be of use. That's the door to the pharmacy. We should be able to find pills for Larry in there. Um. Well, it looks like it's not gonna give me the choice to pick up that cane. So, I guess I need to figure out another way. Definitely need. Nope, that's. Food. How are we doing? Good. Want to go have a look around outside? Yes. Let's have a look around. <sighs> okay. Fuck. Anything. That I can use. Hey man, what are you doing? We can't even think about going out there. Okay, the crotch are out there for sure. I'm just trying to, yeah. That guy over there has the keys. How can you be sure? I found this in the office. That boy. There we go. The keys being on him. Fucking dialogue, finally. Make. Yeah, I agree. Just need to figure out how to get out there and get them. You wouldn't need long, right? Nah, just a few seconds. Maybe there's a way to distract them and buy you some time. I can't reach that brick. A few seconds of searching him, we'll know if he has the keys. Those TVs are on, and I'm sure they're making a lot of noise behind that glass. Gotcha, I can't reach that brick. Open sesame. That won't work. That God damn key. it. It's universal, but not that universal. I know, Doc. It's doing what locks do. What the fuck? Why is that even a, a thing? I can't. Okay. There's that. Huh. Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? I did, but it was too risky. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Gotcha. Okay. No, that's... Huh. Yeah, that's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Those TVs are on. No, sure it's not giving me that any kind of option. Eyes. And I know I need that brick, but it's just trying to figure out how to get it. Gotcha. I I think that's just gonna say the same dialogue, and then. I can't reach that yep. brick. Probably not. Like, it's only going to give me these three options, and I've already did these three options. So I'm trying to figure out what I can use to get that brick closer to the door, or closer to the place. should think about searching that guy across the street. Maybe he has them, but who knows if he actually worked here. Doc, you want to get this door open? About that. You've got the combo, right? Okay. No. 
Did anyone ever have it? Look, man, there were a lot of those things trying to get in here. And now we can't get back out onto the street. But we're also party to some egregious fire code violations. Okay, that was at least a little bit more fucking dialogue. Ah. It's a combination lock. I can't reach that brick. Nope. Damn it. Does he have any more? Nope. Ah. God. Poor kid. I've got to knock that lock off of there. I imagine going out the back door and around is out of the question. If we're gonna help Larry, we need to get this lock oh, off. God of damn it, the fucking crotch shots. <laughs> Did you guys try to get in there and get weapons? Yeah, this is the same dialogue. It was too risky. Damn it. And then a bunch of guys showed up and they tried. And what happened? I think they're most of who you see wandering around out there. Alright. Figure this out. No. We break that lock off and I can get out onto the street. So we need to figure out a way how to break the fucking lock off. That's fortification. We can. I can't reach that brick. Well, we can't fucking reach the brick. I want to make sure I trusted all options before. Well, I guess I'll just fucking walk through this one more time, and then if I exhaust all dialogue through here, I guess that'll be a good note to go back yeah, inside. That's a hasty fortification job over there. Yeah, it didn't work. Okay. What's everyone like in there? Oh, well, Carly's pretty nice, you know. <laughs> yeah. Lily doesn't take any crap. She's been running the show, keeping people on watch, things like that, and her dad. Yeah. Yeah, that guy. He's kind of a dick. Pardon my French. Uh, yeah, sure. I'm open to tips, Anna. All right. Ah, uh, fuck. Go back Let's inside. Back inside. Okay. Talk to someone to bring with me. Ah. Well, we do. If you don't mind, I think my family and I are gonna rest for a bit. Let me know if that asshole over there takes a turn for the worse. You got it. Gotcha. Oh, okay, I'm fucking retarded. Carly. That's... That's the the girl with the radio who doesn't know how to put in fucking batteries and and reverse them whenever the radio doesn't work. Okay. Yep. Here, I've been finding some stuff to eat. Oh, um, uh, thanks. You're welcome. Are you sure your girl doesn't need it? She's good. I've been trying to keep her fed and watered. You're a good caretaker. Thanks. <laughs> hey there. Ah, uh, are you okay? Okay, ready, you ready to, head to head out. out? You got it. You? Yeah. Let's go. We 
we find ourselves in Motel. Gotcha. Did you see that? Sure did. Be ready to shoot. Guys! Oh, man. I'm glad you're here. Jesus, Glenn! Uh, right then wasn't so hard. Can we get out of here before any of these things notice us? Not yet. There's a survivor trap up there. No way! We gotta go, now! Listen. I was out here looking for gas, and then, up there in the corner room, I heard crying coming from inside. Who is it? It's a girl. We talked and she got frightened. I was trying to get in and help her, and she started yelling and saying I was bitten. I tried to convince her I wasn't, and that's when all these guys came out of the forest. A, a couple almost got me, and I ended up hiding in the ice machine. Lucky you. Now let's go. We can't just leave her. Damn right we can. You guys are suicidal. Over a girl! I'm saving her, with or without you. Think about if it was you. Fine. Let's go save Glenn's damsel in distress. Gotcha. Damn straight. <laughs> 